Good morning, East Jackson. Today is Thursday, March 19th. Happy birthday today to Addie Turner. We hope you have a great birthday. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the East Jackson Pledge. We, the Eagles of East Jackson Elementary, pledge to respect and help each other, take care of our school, and be responsible for achieving our goals. Please remain standing for the moment of silence. Think about your goals and what you would like to accomplish today. Today is Thoughtful Thursday. Your parents have been working so hard continuing their jobs, some from home, and helping you with school. So surprise them with something nice today and send us a picture of your idea. A few examples could be cleaning your room or doing chores without being reminded. Um, you can do one of their chores for them. You can bring them a surprise snack or draw a picture for them. Make a card with a sweet, thankful message inside. Send your pictures to our Facebook Messenger or email Miss Rogers by 8 o'clock tonight to be included in our daily Facebook album. Just a reminder, you have today and tomorrow to answer this week's question of the week. On Monday, we asked you to share your space. It's been fun to check out each great learning place. So fun, in fact, we want to share them with you. You might even see a tip to make your space better too. Some students prefer comfort, like a blanket close by. Others like a window and a view of the sky. Some like a pillow or beanbag on the floor. Some even add a touch of holiday decor. Some work on their couch and some stick to their bed. Some even wear fancy earphones on their head. Some work with a sidekick, like a sibling or their child. Some even work with a pet in their lap. That's wild! Some work with snacks or work best with a drink. And some need more than one computer to think. Some work best hunched over and some sit straight up. Some work alone and some teach a grown-up. Tables are popular, so many types to be found. Some are long, some are big, and some even are round. Some work in their PJs, others get dressed each day. Some set up outside when the clouds aren't too gray. Some like being in an office where the noise will stay low. And some build their own office. How about that? Way to go. Some make a strict schedule and hang it up on a sign. Some even make a clip stick to keep their behavior in line. Whatever space works for you, we just hope you know that we are so proud to see you all working to grow. We're impressed to see just how independent you are. Keep doing your best, you digital learning star. Welcome to Student Spotlight. Miss Gates and Miss Vandiver would like to spotlight fifth grader Molly Marcus in Miss Gardner's room. She models great lunchroom behavior and continuously follows the cafeteria rules. Also, Molly helped a friend in the, in the lunchroom last week. A student from another class dropped their lunch and she went to help. What a good friend. We are so proud of her. Welcome to Student Spotlight. Miss Dillo and Miss Missy Brown would like to give a shout out to these students of the Red Hall. These soaring eagles have really shown great examples of manners each morning. Students are greeted with a wave, a side hug, thumbs up, and or a good morning. Red Hall students are now responding to adults and peers with morning greetings. Way to be social, Red Hall. Can you tell me what you say in the morning to other people? Good morning. Good morning. All right. Bye, guys. Have a great day. Have a great day in your PJs.